everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy a really positive week. I'll be using my teacup tarot deck and later on, I will clarify with my Time to Shine deck. Leo, here are your cards for this week, starting the 4th of September from the Teacup Tarot deck and also from the Time to Shine deck. So let's have a look and see what message the cards are going to bring you this week. So your overall energy, the Emperor card, is all about leadership and you stepping up into this leadership role. It's about planning. It's about organisation. It's about moving towards success. Now, the Emperor in the Tarot is ready to go at a moment's notice because everything's ready in advance. And that's just what you need to be mindful of this week. Your help or your hurdle, the six of coins is lovely. This is the universe, it's the pennies from heaven card, showering you with abundance and new gifts and new opportunities. So stay awake for those this week. Your guidance, the ten of wands, says the stressful times are over with, the difficult times are over with. Just rest, relax, have a real quality pot of tea. Gather your energy levels and then you'll be ready for moving off because the next card here in the How Can We Help Ourselves uh, part of the reading is the Knight of Wands. Now, the fastest card in the whole deck, the knights are all really fast. He's the fastest or she's the fastest. Bringing in the message to think it through and act with care. So, as she's charging in with all this information, perhaps the, the ones, it could be a new opportunity, all sorts. We're talking about that here. All sorts being presented to you. Yes, consider it all, but think it through carefully. Pulling it all together, the five of wands says, don't let anybody else's drama Get in your way. Now, look, she can hear this thunder in the background. She can see it from where she is. But she's got her umbrella and her Wellingtons on. She's fine. And this path here leads away from this nonsense and towards the sunshine. And that's just what you need to do this week. Avoid anybody else's drama. And you're clearly going to take notice of that because the Six of Wands is the victory card. Everybody... Waving the flags, it's victory, success, it's joy and happiness. So just looking at the tarot cards to start with, leadership, planning, organisation are your overall energies this week. New opportunities coming in that you need to think through carefully. Rest, relax, put your feet up, think it through, give yourself that breathing space. Avoid anybody else's drama. And when you do all of that, here's the success and the victory waiting for you. So let's get even more clarification and information. Oh, these are lovely. Right. A one of emotion is about an improving intuition. It's also about new emotional experiences. Now, I was talking about happiness and joy here, and here they are flying in here. Wonderful new emotions, happiness, joy, optimism and positivity coming in to find you. The two of action is about positive partnerships, somebody coming in to help you, working well together. It's also about sound decision making and knowing that you are on track and helping you with all of this. The 14 of wisdom is the temperance card in tarot. And this is about bringing wonderful ideas together and it's mixing them all together. So it's compromise. It's balance. It's collaboration and conversation. And the illustration on the card, look, she's baking a cake 
and she's mixing idea one, idea two, idea three, and greatest ever idea together. And when she does that, that's where the success will be found. How can we help ourselves? I was just saying here about compromise, and this is the card, Five of Wisdom. It's the unity card about working in groups. It's about mentoring, teaching, talking things over, having a meeting, working out which way is going to, to serve everybody best. It might even be doing things differently. So you've got a fair bit of homework to do here, but then look at the end of the reading. Ten of Wisdom, this is you moving forward, taking action, delays over, no more delays, no more wondering, pondering, thinking what to do. You've got your information and you're moving on. And here, the nine of emotion, this is you jumping for joy. Success, dreams coming true, high levels of self-confidence. So your mindfulness homework, looking at the whole reading, getting organised, staying balanced and thinking things through carefully, leaving behind any nonsense, leaving behind any drama, making positive and wise choices, compromise, working together, mixing ideas together and when you've done all of that homework here's your wonderful new opportunity for happiness here's your victory here's your success this is you making that move forward and jumping for joy so have a fantastic week thank you for listening thank you for watching thank you for subscribing and i'll see you here very soon